Hey guys, it is me, Hypersaric, and welcome back to Last Day on Earth Survival. So we've just gotten a brand new update, like literally a few hours ago, and uh, I don't think this update is what you think it is. So it is a good and a bad update. I mean, you'll be probably the decider for yourself here. You can decide for yourself. So boom, this is what this update brings us. So season 30 and season 31, even though we're only at season 29 <laughs> right now, it's been a while since the first season, which started in August of 2019. Now it's already season 30 and season 31 coming out with this update. We've come a long way since then. In this regard, we have two pieces of good news. First, we're not going to stop. Second, loads of rewards, including exclusive ones, will be waiting for you as usual. So additional workbenches. That is the new kind of like update update. We've gotten some additional workbenches. Now it's possible to increase the number of recyclers and refine melting furnaces up to two units each. Expansion of the construction limit is available in the end game store so look at this ladies and gentlemen now when you go to the store you can actually purchase yourself a, an, an extra recycler or an extra refined melting furnace so you can have one extra workbench and you can't really build that yourself because for those who don't know it let's actually hop into this base right so because for those who don't know right now you can build a refined melting furnace but you cannot place to refine melting furnaces and the the this update doesn't really change any of that. You still cannot place the second workbench unless you're willing to spend six bucks in this game or whatever amount of money that you have to pay depending on your region. Wait, let's just move this thing back here in the base. I just placed it there for the epic thumbnail purposes. But hey, we have now this workbench and we still cannot place the second one because look at this one. We click on it, I try to move. It still says maximum one. But let's say if you have some deep pockets and you want to buy another workbench, now you can do that here in the store and... Uh I don't know what how to feel about it. I mean, I already know how to feel about it, but I'm just gonna let you guys think. What do you think about this update? Do you think it's amazing? Do you think it's the best update you've ever seen? Or do you think it's a terrible update because... If you're a free-to-play player, you're not going to be able to get this workbench. And it's not even about free-to-play player. It's not about that. It's about that you can't unlock content in the game with playing. Like, I don't mind buying things in the game if that speeds up the process, right? But when you buy something that other people can't unlock, it's... It's not really speeding up the process. Which again, you are kind of speeding up the process with another workbench, right? You might argue that, oh, you can just use one workbench, it's gonna be twice slower. But it's still, it's still not really that cool. It would be awesome if we could actually place another workbench on our own. And if I'm not mistaken, also now we can buy the fridge. I have actually seen that in the store, but now I don't see it anymore. Can somebody confirm that? I've literally seen the fridge in the store and I was not able to buy it, but it's gone right now, unless... Unless I dreamt that, but I've seen it in the sh in the store here. Can anybody else confirm that you can buy a fridge now? Because I think you can do this. And you can also use this. You can also get a second recycler. But yeah, there's that. So what I have to say, guys, that a welcome, welcome to all those that have just joined the stream. Glad to see all of you here. And if you're watching after the live stream, it's over. Then head to the pinned comments down below. There are going to be timestamps and you can navigate to your favorite parts of the live stream a bit quicker. Because I think today we're going to be doing 99 waves. And we will be opening up a few purple cards. So I stick around. Because that's what we're going to do. And we probably keep discussing this update. We'll see what you guys think about it. Yeah, you can buy a fridge. Fridge, uh, Fridges in store, I see, says uh, Eric Langster and Gagak. Thank you, guys. Thank you for letting me know. I see some of you are saying that the fridge is in the store. For those who don't know, the fridge is this thing. Uh, there we go. Boom. This bad boy is our fridge. We can store loot here. And it was available during like some sort of a season. And that's it. I don't think it was available to purchase in the shop. I don't know where we even gotten it from. I think it was during like some sort of an update. And I just realized there's this magnet thing. A metal cutter magnet. Oh my goodness! Metal cutter confirmed! Yes, guys. Metal cutter confirmed. Also, I think the fridge it has changed, ladies and gentlemen. Look at the the details on this scan. The, the resolution has changed. I'm sure about it. It did not look like that before. It's more clear. It's a bit, it's a bit clearer, but maybe I'm just imagining. I'm just imagining it. It was like season 19. Yes, indeed, it's been a while, and ever since that day, we kept probably guessing that hey, one day that we'll introduce that uh, fridge back in the shop, and boom, it is back in the shop. I would prefer to see it here, to be able to get it somewhere in the season pass or when it's somewhere else, rather than just in the shop. But hey, it is what it is. Of the thing that exists and of the things that it is what it is we have the extraction event which 
Sadly, it lasts only for three days. I mean, we still have one hour, one day and seven hours. So maybe I'll try to participate in this extraction event today and tomorrow. Because for those who don't know, it's a pretty decent event if you want to get purple blueprints. Because you can get these two files with rare blueprints. But in order to get them, you need to either spend lots of guns and your grenade launchers. Or you can get lots of points. Lots of zombie crystal points, and then you can build lots of traps and kind of do this event very cheaply. But to do this, you need to clear lots of and lots of places, lots of bunker alphas, laboratories, bunker bravos, etc., etc. So maybe we'll try to participate in that event today, and tomorrow we will do it fully. But all that stuff aside, wait, uh, not actually that stuff aside, we have more events. The Blackport PD event, so protection from explosions uh, plus 20%, and the waves can be paused, the progress won't get lost, electronic circuits won't be needed, uh, won't need to be reinserted. So there's that, we can still participate in this Blackport PD, so that's what I'll do. Hey, what is it? What new thing did they add? They've added a second workbench, guys, I've already shown this, but let's show that again. And now we can buy a second refined melting furnace or a second recycler. You can't really build it yourself, but you can't buy a second one. So, hey, <laughs> there is that, which is kind of goopy in my opinion, because we should be able to get it. Uh, we should be able to build it ourselves, but hey, we, we're not gathered here for that. What we are gathered here for is for last day on Earth raids, and I have some raids outside. So let's go here. And let's do a little bit of research on this base here because we've gotten a revenge raid. And I'm glad that at least it's still here because I've logged into the game like about four hours ago to check this new update. And uh, yeah, I've gotten the revenge raid. LDE raid dice XX 800. So let's see. I don't think I've raided this base in the past because if I raided it, I think I'd remember it. But I don't remember it. All right, guys, I think I know how to raid this base now. That's it. Let's get back to the base. Let's get some loot and let's go for the raid then. Will I get the update? I'm on mobile. Yes, the update's out on mobile. Everybody gets the updates. I mean, not everybody gets them at the same time because I'm pretty certain it's still not out on Huawei's store, on probably Samsung's store and whatever other stores this game exists. At least that's what developers said, but... Yeah. All right, we got this. Uh, what we need to do is um, hatchets. Let's get some hatchets and let's go for the raid. What is the update? We've literally just spoken about the update like three seconds ago. Like literally, I kid you not, three seconds ago. Go to the beginning of the live stream and that's where I talk about it. <laughs> because, but yeah, to those that have just joined, let me tell you again, they've added a second workbench. Now we can buy the recycler and the refined melting furnace, which kind of sucks. Because you can't build it on your own, you can only buy it, so... A pay-to-win update. So there is that. We don't even need probably that many hatchets. There we go, that's enough. Let's take those things, let's maybe get ourselves a C4. And let's go for the raid. WTF, you need to buy it? Yes, indeed. You need to buy that thing, which... It's kind of a lame update, if you ask me. I mean, there are so many... Other things that this game needs, and yet they've added a workbench to purchase, which is kind of sad. If I had to say so myself. All right, let's hop on our chopper and let's go there. Oh wait, the chopper's full. I'm maybe even gonna make a poll so that uh, you can guys answer what you think about this update, if it's good or bad. Is it good or is it bad? Hmm? But first of all, I'm just gonna sort out the inventory here real quick. Yes, make a poll. Yeah, I'm, uh, we'll make a poll. Give us the repair bench for our guns in our base, right? Says Eric Langster. Yes, indeed. It would be epic to have the repair bench. Definitely. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Um... All right, let's make a poll here right now. This... Uh, start a poll. Uh, new... 
the new update added And uh, do you like this update? Yes, I like it. No, it's bad and uh, 50 50 and I don't know I don't play there we go guys we have the poll now you can participate in the poll here You can answer what you think about it And now we can hop on the chopper. Let's go Wait, before we do this. We are at 89 hearth uh, health uh, Hunger I mean hunger and thirst hearth. I want to say hunger and thirst and I said a hearth I was like wait what on earth is hearth? So it took me a while to realize what on earth I've just said there, but it makes sense guys hunger and thirst hearth epic very epic. So we've just eaten and that's it. Get one more Glock. Uh, maybe we should get it or maybe it'll be enough. But I don't just want to... I don't want you to guys look at another loading screen. I've already spent way too much time at the base. So let's just go there for the raid. It's enough of loading screen. Do 99 police department waves is the weekend's event, says uh, Mr. Yes, indeed. That's the plan for the live stream. I haven't seen the good part yet. What do you mean the good part? The good part of the update? I don't think there is the good part of the update. There is the... Wait, is it season 29 or 30? I mean, it's season 29, but they said that it's already season 30 and season 31. But it's season 29, isn't it? Well, in any case, let's drop another C4 here, except I didn't take any because we didn't have any. So let's get our C4 from here. Another explosive. And boom, we got now two chests here to open up, so let's open these up. I don't think we need to explode this wall here because I don't think we're going to get any extra chests there. Yeah, I don't think we're getting that, but what we are going to get is... Uh, is these chests, but I can't even open them up because of the rocks. So let's go to weapons and let's get ourselves a pickaxe. It's like I realized when I went to look uh, that I do not have the pumpkin bike skin. So using the Batmobile uh, bike instead for the Halloween, said Ladybug. Very, very nice. Good to know. But yeah, hopefully you'll get your Halloween bike. Maybe they'll add it again. Oh my goodness, the limestone thing makes lots of noise. So maybe they haven't changed anything because, yeah. Limestone still makes noise. Last time when I tried to chop down a tree, it didn't make any noise, so I thought they fixed it. But no, trees make zero noise. Limestones still make noise. Alright, let's try to chop it down. There we go, chest number one. Here we're gonna get two of those electronic circuits. Let's pick that stuff up. And another wave of zombies. Wait, wait, wait. I do not have the the auto skill equipped. I have the look around skill. We'll need to change it. Look at the C4 graphics. Wait, have they changed something? Have they changed the C4 graphics? Am I... They're the same. They haven't changed anything. Uh, let's go to the auto mode here. There we go. That's way better. Now let's open up one more chest. And another bandage. Wow. This is a pretty uh, terrible raid. That's all I have to say. We still have that weird icon when we try to explode something. Look at it. It's kind of stretched. It's kind of stupid looking. Like, I don't know what's going on with that explosive icon. But hey, guys, this base does not get Sykes approval. Even though it's a revenge raid and it's easy to get Sykes approval during a revenge raid. But this raid was just terrible. Like, seriously. No, the explode the wall contextual one. I have no idea what it means, but all right. Definitely C4 graphics funny. Yes. 
Maybe they already prepared the content inside the game, so no need to, for another update next season. Maybe. Maybe. I mean, it's kind of easy to prepare the content for the next season when there is no new content. Am I right? I mean, they might as well say that, hey, we've prepared content till season 50 and there is no new content. So congratulations. <laughs> we got played, ladies and gentlemen. We got played. I mean, there are some skins, though. Look at this. When we go in the shop here, when we go to the outfits and we got the season 31 reward. So there's this, but do we have season? There's season 29. Do we have season 30 skin? We do not have season 30 skin. There's for some reason season 31. I think they made maybe a mistake. Maybe it's supposed to be season 29 and 30. Because I don't know. So yeah, still the same thing. Maybe season 30 backpack or something. Season 31 reward. Some sort of a new backpack. Season, season, season. And I do not see season 30 backpack thing. Well, well, well. All right, let's drop all of these things back in the chest and let's talk to the raiders and let's get ready for the second raid of the day. And probably after that raid, we're going to start getting ready for another... Uh, for the police department run because we got this special police department rush event today. So why not do it? All right, let's see what do people think about this thing here. All right, so 27% of you like this new update, like the new workbenches. 38% of you don't, don't like it. 25% of you are at 50-50 and 10% of you, I don't know, I don't play, which is understandable. So actually not that many people hate this update. Majority of you enjoy it, which is understandable. Which is definitely understandable. All right, so we need to recycle three guns. We need to deal with this guy. This thing, we need to do a deal with the dealer. And then we can go for the second raid. So let's get ready for the second raid. Let's do it and then let's go for the 99 waves. Uh, we need bandages first, aid kits and alcohol. Let's go, let's take those things. Uh, also, I found out that level 74 is the highest level for the bike. I'm at max level with my chopper now. Pogs is Ladybug. Very nice, congrats on your max level chopper. I still have quite a way to go. Um, the stones. Let's drop the stones all the way there. Wait, now we can make two melting furnaces. Yeah, no, you cannot make. You can buy a second melting furnace. You can't make another one. You can buy another one. So there is that. We need to get this, this, and some alcohol. Let's get it. I mean, it is kind of new permanent content. Everyone joining like update only to find out there's just new pay to win features added. Yes, indeed. New pay to win permanent content. I mean, if not, if that's not awesome, I don't know what is awesome. All right, let's go now to this dealer, Joe. Let's make an epic deal. Which again, at the same time, like that second workbench maybe isn't that super OP. It's not even, I mean... It's nice to have it, obviously. It would be nice to have the second workbench. That's all I have to say. But yeah. From all the pay-to-win things, we have more pay-to-win things, but this thing definitely doesn't make the game more for you to play. That's all I have to say. All right, let's get these things with us, guys, and let's open up this weapon crate. So for those who didn't know, we always play a game, guess and win nothing. That's how I call this game. So guess what we can get inside of this weapon crate, and you will win absolutely nothing. So if you want to win absolutely nothing, guess what we're going to get there. It's almost certain that Kefir have been watching us joke for weeks about making everything pay to win, says DA. Exactly! I just, just before I started the live stream, I was thinking about that myself. Like, they must have seen those live streams where we made jokes about, like, hey, screw free to play players. If I was is Kefir's CEO, I would ban all free to play players. Like, this thing, guys, is just the beginning. Mark my words. 
it is just the beginning. Like now, in the beginning, you buy the second workbench. And the next thing you know, you'll have to buy the game. And then you'll have to buy healing items and you'll have to buy everything. All right, so now we can open up the chest. I, I'll participate in this game myself. So we're going to get here a pipe and we've got a machete. Machete and we have a decent amount of people who have guessed that it's a machete. So uh, John, Paul, Ivan, Ivan, uh, uh, Dart, uh, Sinosaur, Tonky, Potato. And that's it. Those were the people that have guessed that it's a... Machete, so I can... Hey, congratulations to those people. Congrats, congrats. Very epic. Eric Leinster says, it's a weapon. You have won nothing as well, mate. You've totally guessed it. It is a weapon. I don't know how we guessed that, though. Insane. What are the cost of the furnace? Six euros here. But in other countries and other places, it'll be probably different. It depends from region to region. So there is that. Again, it's not that OP, but it's definitely not an update that'll be like, oh, that's awesome. But some people are happy about the update. So, I mean, who am I to say that it's bad? Like, when you just think about it, right? This game is a... Again, I'm not trying... I'll play devil's advocate here right now. It's a free-to-play game. All right? Oh, wait, it's not a free-to-play play game. Forget it. I'm not trying to say here. I mean, it's a... It's a single-player game. You don't compete here with anybody. It's it's not a multiplayer game. Whatever you buy here in this game, it doesn't affect anybody. And developers haven't removed anything from the game, right? You still... If you want to have just one refined melting furnace, you can still have it. They did not remove that. But to those that wanted to buy another refined melting furnace, now they're going to get another refined melting furnace. So there's that. So they haven't really taken anything away from us. But again, is that a good update? I don't think so. I'd like to say it's better than nothing, but I mean, it's it's literally nothing. I'm not even getting those workbenches because I don't use mine anyways. So why would I get them? I don't have space in the base to put those workbenches. It's not pay to win, but pay to progress faster. Yes, kind of ish. We did this and let's do here. There we go. We've just recycled three guns. So now we can go for another raid. So guys, it's all up to you to make your opinion about that, uh, that second workbench. I already told you my opinion. I don't really appreciate it. I would prefer to get some more content than a pay-to-win workbench. It's just the point is it doesn't help the game's reputation. Like, that's that's the thing. But, if you like it, you like it. There's nothing I can say about it. If you like it, you like it. That's the most important if you like it. If you don't like it, there's nothing we can do about it either. Psycho lost all my loot in Bunker Alpha because an exploder exploded and it rolled away but still got killed. Should I tell the admins, creators of Last Day on Earth Services, Fox 3? <sighs> you can try your luck, but if you died, you lost your loot probably. Nothing's gonna happen. I don't think they'll give anything back, probably. Because you... I think... The exploder exploded and you were rolling away. It was too late. You died, you died. I guess. All right, let's get more hatchets. The update strictly targets new players. What about the OG players that have been waiting for 84 years, says Cody Smith? I think every single update that we're getting right now just targets new players. I don't think we've gotten a good update that would target like whatever players. And to be honest, like anytime, and I don't really blame the developers. Like we've gotten the settlement update, which again, it was terrible, like not terrible, terrible, but there's no new content in it. So it's not really a good explanation, but I've seen people complaining about that. Hey, you need to clear uh, the highway like five, six times to get enough thingies to finish the minivan, which 
it's like super easy. Like it's like those things are basically free. And that update was like targeted to like mid-level players. And if people were still complaining about that easy update, then why would they add anything towards like old OG players? If people will complain about it because it's too hard. All what I'm trying to say here is that we don't have the helicopter yet. <laughs> That's it. We don't have the helicopter. On the plus side, at least they released two updates this month. That's a bonus, I guess. I mean... We've gotten two updates this month, but what were those updates? I don't know. I just joined. They added what, says Andrew? Well, to those that have just joined, the developers have added a second workbench that you can purchase now in the shop. It feels weird as if it's like... <laughs> They knew what they were doing with that, right? It's like people are asking, uh, was it the new update? And I have to say, oh, they added this new recycler and the refined melting furnace in the shop. And it's like, it feels like I am promoting those recyclers and refined melting furnaces, which I'm not. It's just that that's what was added in the game. I'm sorry, guys. We've gotten a brand new update just for those new workbenches. What can I say? I had to update the game to get this. You can buy the fridge now. Yes, indeed, Vazvan. You are absolutely correct. You can also buy the fridge. Which, again, it feels like I'm just promoting the things to buy in the shop. I am not. Last day on Earth. Raid Lurzays. Lurzays. Let's see if this base is awesome or just another trash. Yay or nay? Trash or pass? All right, this is a decent base, I guess. Probably. Alright, so let's try to enter it then. Let's go for the right number two of the day. Sorry, Psych Fridge is gone in my store. You cannot get it. So, wait, they've removed the fridge? Maybe. As I said before, I started it. Before I started the, the live stream, it was in the shop as well. Like, about an hour, maybe two hours ago. Now it's gone from the shop as well. Maybe I cannot buy it. Maybe you can no longer buy that fridge. I don't know. Alright, let's sort of chop down this wall. Except I feel like I'm chopping down a wrong wall. From all the walls, how do you... How can you mess up this badly? Please tell me I can go through here. Yes, at least we can go through there. Alright, so now we have a couple of chests to open up, so let's try to soften them up. I heard that radio! It was... Doing those weird noises. It was like... You could hear the static behind that door, but I was like, there's no way I'm that unlucky. It's not there, but it was there. It was a wrong wall. Yes, indeed, it was a wrong wall. Somehow, I ain't surprised. Totally not surprised. Or maybe if you already have the fridge, it doesn't show up in the shop. I mean, if you already have the fridge, you won't be able to buy the second one. That's the point. When I got the fridge offer in the shop, it was grayed out, like it didn't allow me to buy it. It's not like I tried to buy it anyways, but the button was grayed out. You could not buy it because I already had the fridge. But... Those who don't have the fridge, maybe it's still in the shop, I don't know. But it's not really like an update update. But it was a new update. You can buy the fridge only if you don't have it. Yes, that's absolutely correct. Let's open up now another chest here. 
Uh, we can get a little bit of nails. Let's bring that stuff back to the base because we need those nails for the extraction event. Uh, six gasoline canisters plus some um, bottles with gasoline. The warehouse and the fridge are next to the new recycler and furnace, but it says sold. This says a uh, truffle gar, maybe. Maybe, maybe. All right, let's open this up. We've got in here some paint. And let's open up one more. Wait, before we open it up, maybe I could destroy this door. There we go. We have a few more chests here, but if I'm not mistaken, these chests are kind of useless, kind of empty. But before I open up more of these chests, let's run back to the chopper. Let's drop the loot. And then let's start opening up those chests. I wonder if you try to place a second furnace without buying, would it work? I mean, how expensive is it? We can try it out on the live stream. I mean, some of you maybe have already tried that. It's not a melting furnace. It's a refined melting furnace. And where is it? It's here. I mean, it's pretty cheap to craft. I'll try to craft it on the live stream regardless. If you guys tried it or not, just for the content, baby. But I don't think it'll work. Imagine if it works then, like, pfft, but it doesn't work. I'm pretty certain it won't work. I do it now, but it's not working, says White Devil. Yeah, so probably it doesn't work. You won't be able to place the second workbench, but I'll still try to craft it. But yeah, I don't think it will work. All right, so let's try to soften up some of these chests. How many hatches do I have left? Not a lot of hatches left. I don't think I'll be able to open up all of these chests anyways. Unless we can because we have a few uh, hatchets in the inbox. So maybe I'll be able to open them up. And if I die from the big one, that's fine. That's the sacrifice I'm willing to make. Okay, let's soften this up this up. Let's now get maybe like two or three hatchets. Uh, equipment. Oh no, it's not here. It's in the weapons. And where are the hatchets? Where are they? At the top. Yeah, there we go. They were at the top. 77 iron hatchets. Dude, you gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. Alright, let's open this up. Uh, zip. Nothing. Alright, I'll try to just open these things up here. Real quick. Oh my goodness. Stop it, idiot! A, a few stones which I might take with me. Alright. Useless. Heal up. Alright, let's heal up. Oh my goodness! What a donut! I think we're gonna skedaddle from this base. So yeah, this base... Does it get Psychic's approval? I have no idea. I have no idea even. I mean, we could... We dropped some stuff in the chopper, but it's not like this was a great raid. We could get a few stones there, but not... I also ran out of first aid, because dude! Dude! I got lucky! I totally left there because I saw that I'm running out of first aid, because I... Totally knew that, so let's get back to the base, and this base does not get Sykes approval. Pretty terrible raid, that's all I have to say about it. Pretty, pretty terrible raid. We need to do some swamp runs with all them hatchets, says the A, yes. We should go to the swamp location one day to, to get a few ash logs. Maybe we'll go there. All right, let's get rid of these broken hatchets. Let's empty the chopper and let's also try to craft that second workbench, the refined melting furnace, if we can place it or not. 
Which probably we can't. Like, I'm not like probably, but I'm certain that we cannot place it. I'm certain that it's not gonna work. But it's not gonna stop me from trying. I just want to try to get my heart crushed. That's it. For the content, baby. Uh, let's drop these things here. And then we got the alcohol that will go over here. No, it will not work. Yeah, I'm sorry that it will not work. I just want to do this here to prove it to everybody, guys, that it's not going to work. All right, so oak logs, bricks, and iron. Oak logs, bricks, iron, plates as well, probably. We need now only stack of oak logs. Wait, do I have oak logs here or not? Oh, we got them here. So, yeah, that's it. We can craft now, guys, another refined melting furnace. I have crafted it. But it's not gonna allow me to place it. I still cannot place it. What if I spam it a hundred times? Maybe that'll work. And boop! And the game decides, you know what? That's it. You can place the workbench. But hey, guys, you cannot. Bloop! That other workbench. It doesn't work. It doesn't let you place it. Whatever. For now, I'm gonna store it here. It's like the new furnace any good? I mean, there are the same exact furnaces as we've already had in the game. Like, nothing really new. You just can place a second one. If you buy it in the store. That was the update. Use auto-clicker, Cyric. Yes, <laughs> with auto-click. <laughs> with auto-clicker. So one of the best updates. You know what? It's kind of crazy. It's either some people didn't understand or they actually understood and they're happy about it. So maybe developers know what they're doing. Maybe I'm just a boomer. Uh, because look at this. I asked the question here. I made a poll. The new update added a, added a second refined melting furnace in the store. Do you like this update? And 32% of you said, yes, I like it. 30% of you said, no, it's... It's it's a bad. I don't know why I said it's a bad. It was supposed to know it's bad. And 28% of you said it's 50-50. And 9% of you said that I don't know. I don't play. So it's like majority of you now like it. Which is good, I guess. So yeah, I might be saying that hey, this update is not made very free-to-play friendly. But you know what? People like it. What can I say? People like it. Devs know what they're doing. Alright, let's go. Let's pay the raiders. Uh, resources. Let's get some common logs and let's pay them with the good old spears. For those who don't know, once you have the mods and once you assemble the mods, you'll be able to craft those weapons with the mods already. Because every time I'll craft a spear with mods, somebody will be like, Oh my god, look at this! Mods! Yes, they assemble with mods if you have assembled the mods. They'll get crafted with mods already. So there's that. Yes, no one likes the update. People do like the update. There are some people that liked it. I don't think people are, like, very ecstatic about the update. Or whatever you say. It's like, they're not the wow, the best update I've ever seen. I think it's a nice addition. Those who wanted it, they're happy. Which uh, it is what it is. But hey, you know what else is? Uh, Bunker... Blah, 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 police department. So let's get ready for the PD. We'll go and do 99 waves. So let's get some of these grenade launchers. Let's repair them. Uh, do we have any more grenade launchers? We have five, seven. All right, apparently we don't have any more. Perhaps we got another one. Yes, indeed, we got one more grenade launcher. And I don't think I got any more grenade launchers. It's even better than the ATV up. This is infinity. Yes. Definitely.
It's very good. Now I can recycle my stuff. Otherwise, it'll take forever f to build the recycler. What are you talking about? And wait, before we go there, I might as well just bring some more guns. Wait, we'll save a trip. Let's do some big brain stuff here. Let's perhaps take a few shotguns. I mean, we have a lot of shotguns, so maybe it'll be a shotgun addition. I mean, we have a lot of shotguns. It's time for me to use them. There we go. It'll be a shotgun addition bunker at a police department run. That's a lot of shotties, baby. A lot of shotties. So you know what, as long as there are some people that are happy about the update, I think that's all what matters. Alright, we got a few more things to finish up here. There, I think we've modded all the weapons, let's go, let's upgrade these bad boys and then let's get ready for 99 waves. More sleeping bags in the settlement. Wait, what? Did they change something in the settlement? Wait, let's go to the settlement. Let's see. Let's see. While your walls are doors, I literally have two, three doors. This thing hasn't been in the game. This thing, or was it always here? Did they add this tool belt with the helmet? I don't think it's been in the game. I see what you mean. Like those sleeping bags, they were not here before. Now some sort of dudes sleep here. In my settlement! Uh, nothing new there. I don't see anything. The BJ says always there. Guys, stop it. Don't lie to me like that. Nothing here. So, well, that's it. They just added those sleeping bags, unless they were all, always there. Sleeping bags were always there, so that's it. Not They haven't added anything, so I just got scammed. Thank you guys for scamming me. Very cool. I wish the truck was a bit cooler. For a zombie apocalypse, it's pretty lame, says Infinity. I am with you on that one. They had the zombie truck. It looked cool. Why did they remove it? Why did they have to remove the zombie truck to get a minivan? Unless you'll be able to upgrade that minivan into a zombie truck, but why not call it a zombie truck? Why is it... Why does it have to be a generic minivan? I don't know why, but I think the zombie truck would have looked better. Definitely. Trust me, Sack, sleeping bags are always there. Maybe. I mean, it's not like I don't trust you. I'm just saying that I got scammed. Some of you told me that they've added new sleeping bags there, but they didn't add anything. Sponsoring Yo, Police Colbert! Department Resistance. Good luck to them. Police Department Resistance. Stop it, Colbert3. Thanks for the super chat. Welcome to the stream. I don't resist. But I am going to clear the police department. I am going to clear it. With grenade launchers. Say thanks for everything, Cold White. Welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. Next up, it will be with the new helicopter or... Will help you to beat creators. What? Siren Master? I don't understand it. Next up, it will be with new helicopter or will... Or I will help you to beat creators. I don't understand what it means, but whatever. Uh, let's deal with these. Oh no, why am I here when I had to go and repair them first? You didn't repair the guns. I know. I know it came here, guys. For no reason. Fix uh, mill cores. Yes, we have to do this. We definitely have to do that. All right, let's go back to the gas station. Oh, 
How hard would it be for developers to declare light bulbs as tungsten filament and give us a tungsten from recycling them? The 20 bulbs equals one tungsten bar. <sighs> I'm not a developer. I don't know anything, but what are you going to do with that tungsten? I don't know. All right, what we can get here. Nothing interesting, really. Black market gets my disapproval today. All right, so let's quickly repair the grenade launchers. You know what? This one is a little bit broken, but let's repair it regardless. Let's go. All right, we can spin. That would be nice to scroll, but yes, but I mean, what are we going to do with tungsten? It's like, there is no things in the game right now. We would just have tungsten. Basically, same thing as titanium. Titanium is in the game, but it's pointless. Tungsten will be on another level of pointlessness. What can we craft with tungsten? A VSS with eight tungsten bars? Like, it's too expensive. Even if they added tungsten right now, like, everything is just too expensive for what it is. We could craft a soul body armor, Cyric. Still kind of expensive-ish. I mean, eight carbon composites or 18 carbon composites still would be expensive. But still, even when they add tungsten, probably some resources, some recipes would change. But yeah. I would like another recycle workbench. There is another recycle workbench, Colbert. Today is your day. Developers have added a second recycle workbench. Colbert's like, wait, what? Excuse me? Maybe you mean that you could craft a second recycle workbench from the tungsten things, but no, no, no. You can get a second recycle workbench in the shop for a small price of $5.99. You can get, you can buy the recycler and the refined melting furnace, and you can have both of them. If that ain't epic, I don't know what is epic. All right, let's go to the PD right now. Let's drop the loot in the locker. <laughs> Colbert OMG. <laughs> yes, developers have heard you. Be right back. <laughs> Very epic. There's that. Does recycling weapon give you anything? Yes. If you recycle full durability weapons, they'll give you something. Because I've been doing tons of it and I got nothing so far, says Mohammed. You need to recycle full durability weapon. Because if you will be recycling low durability weapons, you'll be getting only springs. And also, guys. Speaking of springs... I uh, recently we started playing lots of uh, whatever that game is called grounded right really awesome game I think it's my favorite survival game of 2022. It's really great. There is like insane amount of content There is like so much grind to do in the game and grind isn't like that boring. It's it's really interesting I think the game is really well done. It definitely deserves more attention even though I think it's gotten a decent amount of attention But I think it deserves even more because grounded is a really really fun game a Really fun survival game and yeah there are like the little grass in the game called Sprig, but I always kept calling it Spring. And only and only recently I realized that it's called Sprig, not Spring. So there's that. Speaking of springs, it's a Sprig, not a Spring. There is that. All right, let's. Okay, well we'll loot the guy a bit later. Now let's drop some stuff in the chest here, and let's. Roll. We just need to bring more armor as well. So let's bring some armor. Have you killed the witch? Says uh, Bora. I, I, yes, of course. We've done it many times. Like that. That's the problem of reading a question before, before reading it myself here. I was not supposed to read that question. Because it's a silly question. But I did it anyways. Devs paid YouTube to say good things about it. Good things about what? Paid YouTube what? I, what kind of good things I said about this update? Game killer. What did I say good about this update? I wish developers paid me. If I got a paycheck for this update, do you think I'd be saying that this is a bad update? I'd be like, dude, it is, this is so insane. We've been waiting five years for this update. That's what I would be saying. 
I'd be like, this is the best update. You need to have it. You need to buy this thing right now. But I ain't got a paycheck. So this update is pretty good. That's all I have to say. No permanent content, baby. My mistake, I thought they were not accessible in the game because Tungsten was not available, says viewers. I mean, even if Tungsten was available, you could craft this assault armor, but you wouldn't craft it. I mean, it's not like there's anything interesting in the game that would Tungsten unlock anyways. Like, let's say they added Tungsten right now, but there's nothing we could do with that Tungsten anyways. Like, there's nothing you can build with that Tungsten. Like, the repair station would be cool if that would repair guns. Yeah, sure. That's the only cool thing about it. I guess. Uh, we came back here for more armor, so let's get that armor. Let's get it. And will those shotguns suffice? I got a decent amount of shotguns, but will that be enough? I've been waiting for this update since I recycled all the junk in my base and smelted all the steel I own. Yes. And finally it's here. I'm so happy. We can craft the safe. Yeah, we could craft the safe. But again, it's like if they're going to add tungsten, they will remove some of the recipes. Some things require titanium, but as soon as they've added titanium, they've changed the recipes. But Cyric, guys, don't but Cyric me. It's not my fault. I didn't do anything. Thanks for your opinion. It wasn't an opinion. I didn't give my opinion. Uh, let's get the canned food. It's kind of weird when the canned food icon here is less sharp than the icon on the fridge now. Look at it. The fridge icon here is more sharp than that one. You can probably see it. Got him, Saskol, but very epic. Very cool. Uh, all right, we're going to now go to the police department. It's like, did you get them? I mean, I don't use them. Why would I get them? You know what else I just realized, guys? After five years of playing, there's this tiny uh, lantern here. It's like a a huge lamp, you know? I don't even know how would you call it, like there's definitely a word for it, but I don't know. But there's a light here, a huge, huge flashlight. It's not a flashlight, but it's a huge lantern there. Floodlight, right? Those are probably called floodlights. A huge floodlight. That's what I've seen. That's content, ladies and gentlemen. That's attention to detail. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Cole, but thanks for the super chat, but you can't force me by thanks. Stop it. I can't buy it because I don't need it. I don't use it. I'm not going to use it anyways because I don't don't log in there. Let's drop it here. Go get him. <laughs> Go get him. Thanks Cobra 3 for the super chat, but you can't do it. You can't do it. I don't use the workbench. Last time I used my recycler was probably months ago. Like, I don't really recycle anything there. I have plenty of my own recycle recycler. And same thing with the, with the furnace. I don't use it. It's like, oh, but hopefully you're not mad at that. But yeah, I can't buy it because I don't use it. Buy them and delete them for the science. Nah, that'd be stupid. I wouldn't do that. Or would that be stupid? Mm -hmm. When will there be more Grounded, says Ryan Hardy. Probably tomorrow there's a new video of Grounded. I'm so excited for more Grounded. 
definitely there will be more grounded. All right, let's hop back here. Um, let's drop the thing is here. Whatever they call the police department card. Okay, we are gonna drop it here. And I came back here for some more shotguns. Let's get the shotguns. I bought, then deleted the new update, says DA. That'd be a good title. Yes, that'd be insane title. I bought and deleted the new update. Bought and then deleted. <sighs> and the, the, the weirdest thing is that it sounds like a happy psychic video. Like, it sounds like something I could do. So guys, don't tempt me. Whatever, let's get this amount of things. And I think I am ready. Alright, let's go. Let's repair the weapons. It's like, what should I do after getting the chopper? Uh, do the chopper event. <laughs> what should I do after getting the chopper? <laughs> that you can do the chopper event and continue playing the game, I guess. There's a flying cockroach behind you, so I guess I know that's my pet. Meet my pet, flying cockroach. All right, we got the hatches. We uh, not the hatches, but the shotguns. We got everything. Time for us to go. Time for us to roll. Let's up this bike. Use the resonator for 99 waves. Resonator is terrible for 99 waves. I was like, that makes sense. Thanks for letting me know. You're welcome. That's why we do the live streams here again. It's even pointless to use the reanimator here right now, right? Because if we die, nothing's gonna happen because it's the special police department rush event. <laughs> feed the doggos. Uh, okay. Sorry for another loading screen, but yeah, let's go. Let's feed the doggos then. You guys told me to feed them, so I'll have to feed them. Does the weapon get repaired after modifying it? No, the weapon does not get repaired after modifying it. Um, all right, we got this, this. What else do I need? I came back here for something else to feed the doggos. Let's feed the doggos, ladies and gentlemen. Stack of turkey. Special day, two stacks of turkey. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. Each stack for the new workbench. <laughs> for the second additional workbench, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go. There we go. Now they can eat for 12 minutes. Epic. Gave them 40 turkey. That'll be enough for 12 minutes. Buggers. 12 minutes and 13 seconds. Alright, let's get that off from this place. One of the doggos only eats carrots. I think dogs eat carrots. I'm pretty certain they do eat carrots. I'm not gonna say that it's extremely healthy for them, but I think they eat carrots. Right now we are ready guys for 99 waves. We are ready. Are you ready? Because I am ready. We are ready. 17 more spots and I will open 75 weapon crates. Can't wait. 17 more spots. What do you mean by spots? 17 more spots. Hey, Sack, when is the next Miss Survival video? Says Beast was. Um, I don't know. Probably I'm just waiting for the new Miss Survival update now. Maybe there will be another video as well before even the next update, but currently there is not much left for us to do besides building the garage, which I'd love to build. But for that, I need to refresh a bunch of loot there and it's not really 
that fun. So I don't really know, but we'll see. Uh, Alright, so we're gonna go back up. What's the new update? Alright guys, so during this new update, developers added an ability to purchase a second workbench and... Uh, oh, it's in the building, yeah. You can now purchase a second recycler and a second refined melting furnace. You cannot build a second one in your base, but you can buy it. That's the update. You can have a second workbench. Alright, let's let in the doggo here. And I think I'll deal with these guys here right now real quick. It'll be a bit easier to deal with them. Lame update says Freddy Fazbear. <gasps> you can't say that. As beer, huh? You can't say it. It is insane update. Repeat it with me. Best update. All right, let's go wave number one. Uh, but before we do this, we need to get the timer. Where is the timer? That's the question. Uh, here. Where is it? There we go, it appeared. And boom, ladies and gents, we got the timer, so we should be able to start it, and this is how we stop it. All right, cool. So the timer works, and we can do the speed run. So let's check it out, guys, during this special event. There we go, let's start it. So yeah, to those that have just joined, we are doing 99 waves during the special event, like police department boss event. Here you can basically die and come back, and the waves will continue. And we're doing the special shotgun edition thing, because I'm going to be using only grenade launchers and shotguns. Is that waste of weapons? Probably. Should I be saving those shotguns for something else? Probably. Am I still going to use them? Yes. Because why not? Let's go wave number... Uh, I don't even know what wave is that. Alright, wave number six. It is faster to deal with those riot zombies with the shotgun. Just mentioned that stupid riot zombie and it and he picked up the shield. Stupid. And to those that have never cleared police department in the past, so you need to pick up your cards every few waves, otherwise those cards will start despawning as there is only a limited amount of dead bodies that can be on the map at the same time. So they will despawn some of them, and I've even witnessed that myself, like with my own eyes. And you guys saw that yourself on the live stream once. I think I didn't pick up like maybe 30 or something cards and they started despawning, but probably five of them despawned, so... Be careful and always pick them up. The best way to not lose any cards is just pick them up every wave and that's it. And you won't have to bother about it. Alright, we've already done 10 waves and it's been 2 minutes and 30 seconds. Not that bad, not that bad. I think maybe shotguns uh, are quite decent. Are shotguns faster than... than scars? I don't think so. Or maybe they can speed up the process. I don't know, we'll see. We're about to find that out. Yeah. 
There we go. Let's go wave 13. Wave 14. So far, I'd say we're killing it. Yo, it's Siren Master. Thanks for the super chat. Welcome to the stream. Uh, once again, hello, hello. I'll read it again. Uh, sorry, I meant to say, oh, the new update, they will add a helicopter or will help you beat up the devs. That's I, I kind of understood what you tried to say there. It's always stupid to threaten or say anything like that towards the devs, even in the joking manner. So never do that. Thank you very much. Welcome to Cyrix Talk. Sarek's dead, Doc. Alright, let's pick up these cards and let's go. For more waves. I should have picked up those cards way earlier. Pick up cards, bro, says Gaming Nerd. Yes, I should have picked them up way earlier. Because some of them might have despawned already. Or maybe none of them have despawned yet. I don't know. Let's go wave 17. Wasted a spread shot. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. That's how you waste a spread shot. Let's go wave 18. And grenade launcher is going to break. Bro, feed the doggo. I literally just gave them 40 turkeys. What do you mean feed the doggos? Change MGL, yes indeed, we've just changed it. Let's go wave 19. And wave 20. Twenty-one plus. We'll need to switch the armor. Maybe after this raid, uh, after this wave, not raid. I've done so many raids that everything I do is just a raid. At this point, all right. Let's pick up the cards and then perhaps I'll switch to a different armor. I think that's what we'll do. What video are you posting tomorrow? Says Trifon. Tomorrow is probably grounded. It's probably grounded. This, this, and it's still enough. You know what? We still can use this armor. Let's go wave 22. Wave 23. You know what? Shotguns aren't that bad. Again, feels kind of maybe wasteful to use them, but I don't think they're that bad. I never said that they're bad. Most of the time I never use them because it feels like it's wasteful to, to, to waste them like that. But that's it. But that is it. Oh, there we go. How is Seawood doing? The Seawood is doing great. For those who do not know, uh, Seawood is the name of our ship in Raft. And our seawood is doing great. I mean, I haven't checked on it yet, but it is doing great. The goat is the captain. I left it in charge. So why wouldn't it be doing great? All right, let's go wave 26. Twenty seven. Are we gonna watch Sire get five purple crates today? I mean, if we get fifty blue cards, then yes, I'll open up five purple crates. But if we get like twenty blue or something, then I'll open up only two purple. Will we use cards today? Yes, obviously, we're gonna open up the cards. Of course. Wave. 
All right, let's pick its stuff up. How are you gonna do waves? What? Like, we are literally doing waves right now. We are literally doing waves here right now. And the best tips and tricks that I can give you about doing 99 waves is just save up your grenade launchers and then do 99 waves with grenade launchers. Each grenade launcher does 16 shots. So you need about like, what, seven grenade launchers or something? And then you need a few weapons. What is your favorite update ever? The update... Again, let's try to answer it seriously. Again, I wanted to answer it with sarcasm. Like, oh, the... The Gold Rush event update or... Or, or whatever else. Like, this update, the second workbench is my favorite update. But probably my favorite ever update that we've gotten in the game. I don't even remember. I don't like any of them. <laughs> I don't know, guys, what update was my favorite update. I mean, ATV update was kind of cool. That was, like, kind of the biggest update. I think the ATV update was my favorite update. That's what I have to say. Also, Season 1 update was kind of... fine. There was a lot of hype around that Season 1 update, I guess. Like, the first few seasons and... Uh, And, and what else? First few seasons, the ATV update was great. It's like play Frostborn and it's pretty great again. It says Stanley. Uh, maybe it is great. I'm not saying that it's bad. But I probably won't play it. Recently, I made a poll, like, probably during the last live stream, I asked you guys, should I play Frostburn? 50% of you said I shouldn't play it. And I agree with you. <laughs> so that's why we're not playing Frostburn. Plus, there are lots of other games that I'd rather check out. Fortmus, by far, said no one says DA. I mean, Fortmus was a decent update, decent challenge, except they removed everything. After it was done. But it was a decent challenge. When did you start playing? I started when the Genesis Laboratory was added. I started when the game was released. There we go. Well, a few weeks after it was released. Because there was... Because... Yeah, there are people who have started way earlier than me. Like a few weeks earlier than me. So yeah, I'm not gonna claim to be- Oh, I was the first player here. I was the first Last Day on Earth player. As there's that meme, if Last Day on Earth has thousand fans, I am one of them. If Last Day on Earth has one fan, I am one of them. If Last Day on Earth has no fans, I am dead. The meme goes something like that. If Last Day on Earth has no fans, that means I'm dead. The big one killed me. There we go. I just improved the meme. Smash like, guys. Smash subscribe for more epic jokes. All right. Let's do this. Sadly, don't have a spreadsheet. It hasn't loaded up yet. Oof. Red shot, and I think we can do maybe one or two more waves, and then I'll start picking up the cards. I think we can do it. There, let's do one more wave, then I'll pick up the cards. That's it. Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Six spread shot, in my opinion, and time for us to pick up these cards. So far, we only have four blow. Which isn't a lot, in my opinion. Pick up after every round to get more blue. That's not the truth. Oh my god, I'm sorry for blabbering nonsense here. It's fine, you're forgiven. You wouldn't be the first one. And there is that guy. I've cleared police department. 
two and a half times and I've gotten seven blue cards. I think I know what I'm talking about. And I'd say to that, yes, you sure know what you're talking about. Definitely. Pick up the cards. Every wave. If you want to get even more blue cards, pick up the card even before the wave ends. Every time a zombie drops a card, pick it up. Don't wait until the wave ends. Don't kill all of the zombies. Kill them one by one and pick up those cards right away. Actually search the pockets of those zombies and snatch their card out of their pockets and you'll get more blue cards that way. But all jokes aside guys, all sarcasm aside, you won't get more blue cards by picking up cards every wave. It's all random. So it is all random. But hey, do whatever makes you feel better, right? If you feel like you'll get more blue cards picking up every wave, every wave, then yeah, sure, pick it up. You should be picking up cards every wave anyways. Because they... They spawn after a certain amount of dead bodies. Search them while they're alive. Yes, indeed, that's what I'm saying. Search those zombies while they're still alive. If we can call them alive, because they're kind of dead, right? But you got the point. Search them while they they still can move. Uh... Oh, no. Oh, no. My grenade launcher. Oh, my goodness! Damn it! I knew it. It's... It's the chat, guys. It's the fault of the chat, guys. It's your fault. I'm sorry about it. I've never blamed my chat in the past. But I'm so sorry. I am so sorry. And the timer is still ticking. We gotta go there. It's like, pause the timer. It doesn't count. Who made these rules? I literally made up these rules and the timer counts. I don't know how to pause it. There is a pause button probably. Yeah, I can pause it. So yeah, there's that. Uh, let's drive back there. Your fault for being a sarcastic jerk all the time. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I am a sarcastic jerk now. Epic. Very epic. Alright, let's go there and let's continue those 99 waves. Uh, I'll get the body. We need to get more... Grenade launchers. Don't we? And a new armor. There we go. Wave 40 something. 47. Yes, he's sarcasm. Yes, guys, I am sarcasm. Welcome. Somebody said once, like, you know, that's where the, the joke is coming from. Sark, are you serious or a sarcasm? I am sarcasm. <laughs> I'm somewhat of a sarcasm myself. Let's go to wave 51. It's been 17 minutes. We're not beating any records. I died. I went back to the base and the timer kept rolling. Of course, we're not going to beat any records. We just got in a nice comment there. I want to read it. Actually, something that I didn't know and never experimented myself. Uh, I just discovered that wave 50 to 70 doesn't count for the Raiders task. 
Now I have to wait three days for the reset, says Gary Singer. That makes sense. I mean, I didn't know that, but yeah. It maybe doesn't make sense. What I try to say is that, hey, I didn't know that. Thanks for letting me know. So it only works from wave 1 to wave 20. Okay. That is interesting. Also, wait, if I'm not mistaken, you can even surrender. Oh, there is no surrender button. There is just a pause button. So it's literally impossible to fail. I almost got into that explosion radius. You just jumped from five to nine blue so fast. Yes, it does happen. It's... It is... It is random. Sometimes you'll get, like, not a lot of cards. But as I always say, the rule of thumb is about one blue card every 10 waves. But sometimes you won't get lots of blue cards in the first, like, 10, 20, 30 waves. And sometimes you'll get more card cards by the end. Sometimes you'll get more cards in the beginning and you'll get less cards at the end. Sometimes you'll get a lot of cards all the time. Or and sometimes you'll get no cards. So there's that. We're already at 10 blue. Which is pretty decent, if you ask me. And yeah, that happens only during the PD event. At normal PD, you can reset, yes. At normal police department, you can reset. And at normal police department, you will die and you won't be able to continue the police department waves. You'll have to start from zero by giving an electronic circuit back to this terminal. So if you're watching this live stream and you think like, oh, that's cool. And then you die and then you're like, oh, why it doesn't happen? Because the event isn't here. Because you can do those things only during the event. Like pause the police department waves and die and then come back here and continue from wherever you left off. And to find out if that event is here or not, then just go to your calendar events and check if there's the police department event. All right, the shotgun is almost broken. We might as well just eat it. Let's go wave 60. A bit over halfway there. You should use landmines near the gate. Try that. Yes, guys, you're absolutely right. If you didn't know, you can use uh, landmines near the gates. Just type probably Happy Psych PD landmines or something. And there'll be a video of how we use landmines in the police department. We've done that probably two or three times now, where we've cleared 99 waves with just police with just uh, mines. Should have used the spread shot on these guys. Definitely. Wave 60, you got only 11 blue. What do you mean only 11 blue? It's a pretty decent amount. Oh my god, so I got cleared police department once. I had 12 blue at this point. What is this, guys? What? Was I sarcastic joke? Uh, sarcastic jerk here again? A sarcastic joke. For doing a joke here? Of course, no. Some people got 7 blue after 99 waves. That is unlucky. 11 blue in 99 waves is kind of decent. It's like it's average average. Okay, we need to switch uh, to a different armor because this one's about to break. New landmines don't work. 50% of the zombies escape. Well, people have been saying that for... For a few years now. For over a year, and uh, they still kind of work. Armor is gonna break. Uh, yes, we're gonna be changing the armor. Yo, psych room tour. We've done the room tour already. I think just type psych setup tour or something, and it'll be on YouTube. 
pick up the cards that's gonna despawn. Yes, indeed, we'll, we are picking them up right now. That one guy, but Sayaka had thousand blue after one round, says Brandon. Welcome, Brandon, to the stream. Welcome, and you're absolutely right. Some people have gotten thousand blue cards after one wave. Let's go wave 66. Every time he shoots a uh, 2 HP zombie with a shotgun, it hurts as infinity. Yes, it does. I totally agree with you. But as I said, this is a special shotgun edition police department run. I wanted to do the spread shot on both of those riot zombies as well, but hey, that didn't work. We could have maybe waited a bit longer and tried to aim better, but a hey, time's ticking, baby. So we need to do what has to be done. Sometimes that means wasting our shotgun. Actually, I'll do the spread shot here right now. Let's go wave 71. Uh, I should actually pick up the card. Should have maybe started another wave. There we go. We are already at 14 blue, which is kind of decent. And the timer is at 25. I think once we've cleared 99 waves in around this time, right? In about like 20... Five minutes. It's like, can you buy fridge in the new update? Only probably if you don't have it. I can't confirm it 100 for 100 percent. Let's go wave 72. All right, another blue card. We do have a decent amount of blue cards. Like, we could even pull the plug right now and stop it and not go for 99 waves. But we started it, so we're going to continue. So we started and we will continue then. Let's do a spread shot. All right, the shotgun just broke. It's like, why don't you do 100 waves? Because it's impossible to do 100 waves. You can only do 99. Only 99 is available. Sixteen blue. Not terrible at all. Sometimes you can get like 16 or something blue only after 99 waves. And even then, if you get like 19 blue after 99 waves, that's like... A higher average, I would say. And we're only on wave 74, so I'd say we are we got pretty lucky. Alright, this grenade launcher stint can okay it lasted only for one more shot. That's it, now we need to stop using it. Because we'll need to repair it. Wave 77. 
And we got three medkits. I'll need to get more. After this wave, probably. Yes, there we go. At least the shotgun somehow, some way worked. I was able to damage those right zombies. Alright, we still have a few healing items. Let's get that. And wave 78. What did I save that grenade launcher or did I break it? I don't remember now. I should have saved it. It's like, show me what the new update is about. You can rewind the live stream to the very beginning. That's where I explain what this new update is about. We've gotten two new workbenches that you can buy in the shop. Two new workbenches, but they're kind of old workbenches. You can buy the refined melting furnace and the recycler in the shop now. So you can have now in total two recyclers and two refined melting furnaces, but you can't craft them yourself. You can only buy that stuff. All right, perhaps let's switch to a different armor. We could still use that one for a bit longer, but it's fine. I already changed it, so it's delayed. Wave 81 and we're almost at 30 minutes. And I think while we are out the top here, I think we can go and loot the bodies. Real quick. 22 blue you're gonna get, I guess, says BJ, maybe. Perhaps, perhaps, perhaps. It's absurd that I have to spend 18 bucks to access the new update. Well, I do agree on that. I really thought that one day developers will let us craft a second refined melting furnace or something. You know, it would be cool if you unlock, let's say, at least an ATV and then you can go to the swamp location and with that swamp location you can craft something that would allow you to craft more of those workbenches. I think that would be at least something. But hey, apparently we're not getting anything. Robert Allen, what new update? Yo, welcome Robert Allen to the stream. I just said what the new update's about, but basically they've added uh, two new workbenches in the shop, but they're not totally new. You can just buy a second... A refined melting furnace and a recycler. That's it. You cannot build them. You can just buy a second one in the shop. So hopefully that answers your question. Uh, so it's kind of an update. Kind of a... Kind of an update in the shop. That's it. Kind of an update in the end game store. Alright. We are a bit hungry. So let's jog that. Let's go wave 85. 84 still only. Oh no, that is 85 probably. Or maybe it was 84. I don't know, doesn't matter. Good update, says Brandon. Yes, indeed. <laughs> Great update. Psych explaining about the update that we have now two recyclers and two melting furnaces. The dude gets excited for a second and then boom, it's in the store. You have to buy it. Yes, indeed, guys, we've gotten a brand new update. You won't believe it. Now you can finally get the second uh, refined melting furnace and you can build a second. You can have a second recycler. Which is totally insane, except there's one little problem. You have to buy that in the shop. You can't build it on your own. You have to buy that in the shop. Makes an entire video. Speaking about those workbenches and how many more things you can do right now. And at the very end of the video says that, oh, the biggest, the problem is that it's only available in the store. You can only buy it.
Let's get it. Uh, 88. I just want to break this Glock because I brought it. I might as well just break it fully. Free to play player dice from cringe. <laughs> okay. Rip. Wave 90. Careful be laughing there. You know what off. Wait, what? Shadow Duffer, welcome to the stream. I didn't understand the comment. I didn't understand the comment. The Kefir be laughing there, you know what off. I don't know what it means. But alright. Kefir do be laughing. So for everyone who doesn't have the fridge, it's available in the store, probably. Perhaps. Oh, Kefir be laughing there, you know what? Off. Okay, I get it. I understand now the, the comment there. I didn't read it properly. I know what you mean. The, the devs are laughing now. I get it, Shadow Duffer. I'm not that stupid. I might be an idiot, but I'm not stupid, stupid. I get it. They're laughing their butts off. I get it right now. The word laughing didn't register in my brain at all. It's like, they be like, what off? And I'm like, what they be what off? Like, it didn't make any sense. But yeah. We got two kind of good benches. Why no second fridge or a warehouse? I don't know. I don't know. All right, let's get the loot and uh, wait, what wave is it? 93. Still a few more waves to do. Another shotgun. Do we have more shotties? Yes, we should have more shotguns. Another one of those. And let's go, baby. Wave 94. Die at 97. I think last time we died at wave 97. <laughs> it's enough of waves, guys, at 97. Maybe last time we died at wave 98. And even if we die, it doesn't really matter because we can always get back to this place again. As we are, it's, um, is the police department rush event. Let's do a few more waves. Wave 96, and probably after this wave, I'm gonna switch my armor. Yes, that was a really good spread that we've gotten those riot zombies as well as the other zombies. Uh, very, very lovely. Wave 97. Wave 98. Stupid ride zombie. But, but guys, it's not my fault. I just wasted that grenade launcher. Did you see that? It just... The guy just shot it on its own. You can't script this, guys. You can't script this! On the very last wave, I died. I was like, oh, that's a lot of zombies. 
I'll sure as heck explode the boom. Dies. We did it, ladies and gentlemen. We did it. I died. That was kind of hilarious. That was one of the most fun deaths I've had in the game. But so many thoughts happen in my head. I'm like, hmm, that's a lot of zombies. <laughs> Maybe I should have changed my armor. Nah, they're not going to destroy it. Dies. Instantly dies. Well, let's get back there. And let's finish that last wave. Whenever I come to the stream, you die. Lol says Stanley. Stop it! I mean, still stay here. It's fine. It is fine. But you might be bringing the bad luck. Perhaps. Alright, let's go back here. Uh, Ananas says, Psyche, I really need your help since I won in one of the community events in Discord and I took Act 1 Premium as a reward, so the ISP won't appear for me. Do I start a new account or what is your opinion, please? What? What? Excuse me? can read it again to those who didn't hear it. Psyche, I really need your help since I won in one of the community events in Discord and I took Act 1 Premium as reward so the LSP or ISP won't appear for me. Do I start a new account or what is your opinion, please? Uh, okay. Okay, let's get my body. So yeah, my opinion is that I didn't understand the question. I apologize about it. I don't understand the question. I'm not sure what you mean here. Timer. The timer is going because we are still doing it. I'm not done with 99 waves yet. The timer is still going. That's why the timer is still here. There we go. Wasted the spread shot! God dang us. We didn't either sustain. Yeah, I'm sorry, but I didn't understand your question. Make sure to ask that question uh, on Discord or something. Maybe they'll answer that. Don't know. Oh, that's it. Now we did it. There we go. So 41 minutes. I think that's the longest PD wave we've done yet. Sorry, I forgot to update the death counter. Wait, we have 22 blue cards. Could that be the record or our record was like 24 blue or something? And that's even without exchanging any greens. That is actually a decent amount of blue cards, right? 22 blue cards, that's, that's a lot of blue cards. In it, mate. That is definitely a lot of blue cards. All right, let's exchange all of that stuff. 24. Says Sunny. Maybe we had 24 ones. Maybe. Alright, let's exchange all of these brown for green. All this and now all for blue. 30 blue! Have I ever gotten more than that? We can almost get 31 blue. But 30 blue cards, baby. 30 blue. That is kind of sick. 30 blue cards, that's like 60 guns. 60. But no, no, no. We're not going to open up 60 guns here. We won't get them because you know what's going to happen. We will exchange them for purple cards, ladies and gentlemen, for the content. So yeah, I'm just going to drop the loot back to the base because I can't open up the cards right now. I won't be able to bring the loot back to the base. So yeah. Leave your opinion. Should we exchange those blue for purple? Do you want to see a purple crate opening? I'll probably do it regardless, but hey. Let me know your thoughts. 60 Winchester, says Brandon. Yes, I mean, 60 Winchesters are going to equal to about 60 steel. Epic. Did you buy the melting furnace? No, I didn't get it because I don't use the melting furnace or the recycler that much. So it would be pointless for me to get that stuff. Oh my god, Psych, that kind of makes sense. It does. If I used it, like, let's say if they introduced that workbench when I tried to get more titanium or whatever else we can get there. Bricks? 
right? We can smelt bricks, probably. If they introduced this update when I wanted to get bricks for level 5 walls, maybe I would have gotten the, the melting furnace thing. Maybe. Maybe. But even then, that would be uh, under a huge asterisk. Asterisk. How do you say? Asterisk? Asterisk or asterisk? What on earth? English lessons with Happy Psych only here, only right now. Asterisk or asterisk? It's asterisk, I'm sure. Asterisk. Asterisk. It's asterisk. That's what I said, guys. It's asterisk, not asterisk. You dummies. But Psyche didn't say anything. Of course you didn't say anything. Of course you didn't. Of course. All right, let's drop the loot. So guys, we'll be opening up five purple. We just need to sort out the inventory first. We need to drop these guns. And then we'll go for it. Okay, blue cards for now will stay there. This game is actually testing our IQ. Well, our all collective IQ here from all the viewers, I don't think we'd surpass 100. So... I don't know what that's supposed to tell about us, but hey, welcome. We are gamers, ladies and gentlemen. We don't need such things as IQ. What we need is another skin in the game. <laughs> and more workbenches to buy. Yes. Purple machete mod today, says Brandon. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Everything is possible. Everything is possible. <laughs> Everyone in here plus Psych shares the same two brain cells as Infinity. Yes, indeed, guys. What do you think about our two brain cells? They're pretty cool, I'd say. Pretty decent brain cells. What there is a good way. Plus, we still have the timer. Let's remove this stupid timer. And let's go, ladies and gents. So, are you ready for the epic purple box opening? And that purple box is going to contain a machete blueprint. Gonna be very cool, very epic. I am ready. So first of all, again, don't repeat that at home. Uh, for those asking when you should exchange your blue for pur for purple cards, exchange them only once you have a lot of blue cards. Once you have a lot of green cards, let's say you have 100 green at the base, you have like a few blue cards. Then nice. yes, you can start exchanging them for purple. I wouldn't really suggest you doing that. Just exchange. Don't exchange anything. Just exchange your brown for green and keep opening up green cards with blue cards you shouldn't even exchange probably green for blue you should exchange green for blue only once you have over 100 green but to exchange for purple i wouldn't even suggest that just wait for the arena event and you'll get purple cards there there we go there's that but we're gonna open up now three purple cards so let's drop them one two Three. There we go. The only blueprint that I don't have in the game is the purple machete blueprint. So let's see if we're gonna get it. We've got an M16 red laser. Thank you. Probably a good blueprint, but I don't need it. We've gotten a shotgun heavy barrel. Thank you. But I don't need it. And the last chest drum roll, please. I'm actually gonna read the chat, guys. I'll check the chat. You tell me. You tell me. I'm not even gonna look at it. That's it. I'm, I'm just looking at the chat here. There we go. Open it and you tell me if it's a machete blueprint or not. Tell me yes or no in the chat. That's it. I'm not looking. I promise. I promise. That's it. I'm not looking. I'm not looking. I'm not looking. I'm not looking. Let me know, guys. Let me know. Somebody said Winchester. You can't say it. Zip gun. No. Yes. Glock. You got it. No, no. Well, let's see a lot of people saying no. It's a Winchester. Somebody was right. Somebody was actually right. It's a Winchester. It's a silencer for the Winchester. Somebody was right. Wow. Well... Another day. Uh, another day without the blueprint, right? Another day, it's another day without the blueprint. I didn't need it anyways. Yeah. 
It's fine. Who needs that purple machete blueprint anyways? Not me. If I wanted it, I would have gotten it. Totally. Yes. Okay, we've already equipped the new armor. Oh, this stuff here comes with us. This goes here and this goes here-ish. There we go, we did it. Nothing, nothing, there we go. Guys, I think he's in denial, says Infinity. I'm not in denial! Wait, what are the three stages or whatever, like five stages of grief? Anger, denial, and what comes after denial? Optimism. Like, it's fine, guys. We will get that purple blueprint next time. It's fine. <laughs> we'll get it another time, guys. Don't worry. And what comes after optimism? The five stages of grief or something. Five stages of grief. Let's go the... The denial, anger, bargaining, depression, and acceptance. There we go, guys. Let's go through all of them. Denial, right? There's no way I did not get that purple blueprint. Purple machete blueprint. I should have gotten it. I definitely got it, ladies and gentlemen. And then anger. God damn it. I can't believe that. And after that, it's uh, bargaining. But maybe if I sell my soul, I will, I will get it. Maybe I'll get it, guys. Next time, I'll definitely get it if I, if I'm nice enough. And then depression. Like, that's it. But this is the... And then what other stage there is? Acceptance. <sighs> that's it, guys. I accepted that we didn't get any purple blueprints. It's fine. It is what it is. It is what it is, ladies and gentlemen. We did it. It is fine. It is all right. And let's drop the boots. Do you hate crater mode, Sark? I don't hate the crater. I think crater... <laughs> I don't know what I think about the crater. It's like, it's like, give your opinion about like, insert like whatever unimportant thing. It's, what do I know about the crater? It's kind of, it's always sad to say bad things about the crater because I do know that there are some people who like the crater. So I'm like, every time I speak bad about the crater, maybe those people get sad or something. But the crater, I don't play the crater because nobody plays in the crater. If I wanted to play in the crater, I'd play Frostborn. Oh my god, Tark, that makes sense. It does make sense, doesn't it? Forgot the crater even exists exactly. They haven't updated it in over a year, so I mean, how can we play in the crater when they haven't updated it in for such a long time? So, yeah, there's that. What do we need to do? We need to clear the second floor, another C4, then the big one. Actually, it's the blind one. That stuff and that stuff. All right, so we will do all of those tasks. But now we will be probably wrapping it up. But before we wrap it up, guys, we have some more things to do. Maybe like, like what other things? Speed cubing. For those who do not know, every time at the end of the live stream, we usually do a little bit of speed cubing. I don't know why. I thought it's just kind of fun to do something else at the very end of the live stream. It usually takes like about five minutes. We can all hang around here. Hang around. We can hang around. Yes, indeed. Let's go. Let's go, ladies and gentlemen. All right, so first of all, let's get the timer. So yeah, for those who don't know, just some background info of what to expect here. So my personal best was 30.65 seconds. I've gotten it once and I got, and I was very lucky. My average is about 50 seconds. It says average of 100 is 49.71 seconds. So yeah, there's that. So I'll be very happy if I get 45 seconds solved here. Just as always, let's quickly warm up just a little bit. Uh, 
I just want to warm up a bit. Did it somehow, some way? Well, maybe I messed it up. All right, so I think that's gonna be enough warm up, ladies and gents. We can now go for it. Let's go. Now let's scramble the cube. This guy's gonna get exactly 45.89. Well, we will see. We will see if your prophecy will be correct. This, this, down, right, down, back, left, up, back, up, front, down, back, left. There we go, that's it, we did it. Now let's scramble the cube. From your experience, what is the best way to clear Bunker Bravo, says Brain. A Brain Escalera. Well, in the description, there will be the most frequently asked questions section. So I'm pretty certain I'll link there to a video of where I clear Bunker Alpha. But the best way to clear Bunker Alpha is just to spam your guns and that's it. Just spam whatever best guns that you have, like your M16s, fully modded M16s or fully modded AKs. So there we go. That's it, guys. I think that's enough spins. Let's now do... Ooh, that will be pretty good. This, this, this. Ooh, this will be really good. This will be really good. Okay, I'm ready for it. Actually, I'm not ready for it. Okay, I'm maybe ready for it. This, this, this. This, we did it. Could have been better. Seconds, new record! Woo! Again, you do get lucky sometimes. I got insanely lucky here. Could have been even faster. For a second, in, from the corner of my eye, I thought that it's already over two minutes. I already thought that it's over 30 seconds, I mean. I want to say that it's already over 30 seconds, so I kind of didn't really rush at the very end. So I thought it'll be like 35 or something. But I got really lucky here. Like, sometimes you do get a lucky soul. A lot of things just came into place, so there weren't lots of things to to worry about, and I didn't even make there any mistakes because it was pretty easy. So yeah, whatever, we did it. One solve done. One solve under our belt. Epic. So yeah, we're gonna do it again. Obviously, it's not gonna be that easy this time. Well, I think that's enough of spinning it around. Okay, we have this thing here-ish. Okay, that's it. Let's go for it, ladies and gents. Three, two, one, go. Boom.
41 seconds could have been wow got really lucky got the the PLL skip or whatever you call it Pretty great. I mean 41 seconds. So I've got a bit lucky there at the end But even if we didn't get lucky, I could have gotten like sub 50 easy there So pretty decent guys both great solves Both epic solves So yeah, two solves a day that what that's what we usually do we usually do two solves that proves that he's happy about the other. What the the the, the solves here, the Rubik's Cube solves make us happy. 40 seconds you get checked there, what happened? Because there is one more step that you need to do in the Rubik's Cube. For those non-cubers out there, you solve the Rubik's Cube and then there are a few algorithms that you need to perform, and sometimes you get lucky and you don't have to do it, and that saves like a few seconds depending on how fast you are. So it did save me. It depends. Like save me three seconds, save me five seconds. Might have saved me 20 seconds if I would have messed up. But I think we could have gotten an easy sub 50 even if it wasn't for the luckiness. But still, pretty cool. Two lucky solves. And I'm happy about it. That's what Rubik's Cubing is all about. Getting solved. We've gotten the personal best today. 38 seconds. Kind of lovely. So there's this another one for the freshness of mind. You know what? Let's do one more. <laughs> Let's guys, let's do one more. We gotta go for one more. Uh, this down, back, right, down, back. There we go, we did it. Now let's do some more random spins. And let's do the third one. 36 seconds or 28. There's no way we'll get 28 seconds or 36 seconds. We won't even get a sub 40. It's really... To get those sub 40 things, I need to... To not make any mistakes. And I need to see things quickly. Alright, I think that's enough stuff. There we go. Let's look around here. This one goes... Okay, we can do it there. Three, two, one, go. Let's go. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Boom. Forty-two seconds, ladies and gents. Another great solve in this one. <laughs> Every solve involves a little bit of luck, right? Or whatever. It was great. Like this one was. Uh, I got no skips, no anything. Forty-two seconds. Mwah. They were epic. It's like, did you kiss it? I did not kiss it. It was just like this Mwah, from here. Cause Rubik's scoop is dirty, baby. You ain't gonna kiss it. I ain't stupid. But that was a nice solve, guys. Three solves. Three great solves, in my opinion. Three really good times here. So guys, we will be skedaddling now. Thanks everybody for joining here. Have an amazing... Uh, I don't even know what's the day today. Tuesday? Tuesday, yes indeed, I guessed it. Well, have an amazing Tuesday. Bye in French says infinity. Uh, au revoir. Oh my god, thank you. your French is flawless. It is flawless. Thank you very much. Merci beaucoup pour avoir mon vidéo. Au revoir, eh, mes amis. 
Oh my god, Sack, your French is amazing. Yes, it is, guys. Thank you very much. Thank you. I've been using Duolingo now for three days. French is flawless. So take care, guys. All jokes aside, have an amazing Tuesday. See you later, everyone. See you later, alligator. Take care, guys. Take care. Have fun. Take care, guys.